Yo, this your boy Double Up and I'm back with another <coughs> banger And today, I came in to get into that boy Sharp, aka Church You get what I'm saying? I guess he quit, no jumper, you know what I'm saying? Adam 22 responded to what he said If you haven't caught what he said, go check Sharp out on his page You get what I'm saying? But not too much talking I want to uh, know how you guys feeling today, man How y'all guys doing, man, you know what I'm saying? But before we start this video, I need you to like Comment, subscribe. Okay, let's get right into the content. Sort of analyzing, reflecting on Sharp's tenure. Now, the, my, my opening statement, the thing that I really want to put out there that I feel like is the most important part of this is just the fact that I always thought that Sharp was a real one. And I always thought that he would hold it down in the face of whatever. And that when it was time for us to go our separate ways, I figured that he would go his separate way in a respectful way and that he wouldn't use it as a jumping off opportunity. I guess basically I felt like Sharp had not been completely blinded by the clout and become addicted to the clout, which I now see is in fact exactly what happened. Adam 22. Talking about somebody addicted to the clout? Come on, bro. You let somebody hunt your wife, bro, for the clout. All right, let's get back into it. To him, that clout just fogged his brain up, and he's now no longer able to see reality. He's not capable of seeing what it is to be a real one, and instead, he's choosing to move with business. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the pimp has become. The hoe. Jack. Now, oh. he, he may still be a pimp. For yeah, all I, know. I don't know. Belt. But he <laughs> is Girl, behaving in a way that I wouldn't even expect of the lowest of the low of the hoes. And I believe that this has been justified and confirmed by the fact that even bottom feeding clout addicted streamers such as you know who and you know who I'm and little you know who church this is a bitch ass narrative and that uh, yeah. cuz is behaving himself <laughs> like he's out of 22 when to say bitch ass nigga but let's get back into it behaving like something <laughs> that i don't think he was before this and I don't think he wants to be, but let me just tell you, he's, he's someone who is, a, who is used to a certain level of numbers at a certain point. And this might not even be scratching the surface of the numbers that he previously had going for him, but it's like, basically I've been led to believe that the reason why he's not here today is A, because there's certain people that he doesn't want to sit with, but B, he really, really wants to stretch out the, the additional momentum that he has gained from this and doesn't want to go and give the clout to the platform. And as time went by, it became clear that either because holes had been popped in his poked in his persona mm. or mm. in addition, the fact that he really kind of just turned away from the style of content that made him popular at a certain point. Some would say that this is all Masika's doing. Mm. Because really, she's the one who sat down and did a podcast with him that caused him to walk out of his own podcast. Now, what I would like to also acknowledge is that... Hold on, man. Let's, let's start here. Okay. He did the same thing to Adam and all them, and they over there, they yes men, all three of them. Lush, Almighty, and Brick. Y'all, yes, man, bro, because he going to do the same thing to you when the numbers start dropping when you start. How you guys feel? Drop it in the comments. Talk to me. Let me know something. Let's get back into it. Over the years, I have been a great friend of Sharp from my perspective. I have helped to explain his eccentric behavior to various members of the staff and members of my personal life, friends, etc. I've tried to normalize his actions i've never been critical of him ever even though i've sat on podcasts where people tried to get me 
to be honest, tried to get me to open up about whatever has happened in his career. And I've always held him down and I've never felt the need to comment on that kind of stuff. Even when there was a woman on this podcast named Damn Homie who really, I think, permanently shaped the way that people view him. I didn't take the bait, even though, let's be real, a member of the No Jumper staff drinking urine, <laughs> having sex dolls. I mean, this is some funny shit. You know, this is like, uh, it's crazy. Uh, yeah, this yeah, is yeah, good yeah, yeah, Never drank no piss. <laughs> That I'm not so sure about, she, but um, I break. She, I have, <laughs> I okay, break. she did admit to it on stream. Do you guys feel like Sharp, aka Church, drunk the pee pee? <laughs> That's disgusting if he did, but let's get back into it. Like, there is a clip if you scroll that, back I'm a day or two on the Reddit. You've seen the clip. We yeah. all seen the clip. He did admit it. I don't know if that's AI or not, though, my boy. Man, okay, and that's, that's crazy. crazy. And that's the other real. Like, like, I'll, 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 I'll pass the mic to you guys, but that's the other craziest thing that he did was lying about a damn homie clip of him on the phone with her and saying that it was AI. This is disrespectful that's to just, everybody who has ever been framed by AI. Shout okay, out to somebody so like this. It was disrespectful to everybody it was intelligence not, game. It was no, not I, AI. I'm dumb this as is a fuck fucking a, FaceTime. I, I AI? It. Oh, no, no, no. Not, Who's not, making not the, this? Not the FaceTime one. There's like a clip of just him talking and he's like, I had to do what I had to do. You wasn't with me getting it out the mud. Yeah, I had to drink the bitch piss. Nah, I'm not but, talking. Okay. He didn't call it that. That's I, later. I think that was a fucking uh, AI. Yeah, like, nah, he little, said AI way before yeah, that. He has to pick, take drinks. Yeah. I don't know. Nah, I, don't know. I ain't never heard that because when I seen him say it was AI, it was a completely different clip. Okay. I ain't never even heard it that was clip. The one where he when he was, was on the phone. He was yeah. on the phone. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. what he was talking. He said that was AI. That and looked nigga, real. Nigga, you that out your mind. Real. That did look you, real. You feel me? Like, nigga, ain't no way. Stop it. Stop what, it. What, what is illusion? What does he think that every, I mean, every P cheats. Like, I be around pimps all the time, and they all got one thing in common. Nigga, you do not live by what come out your mouth <laughs> in real life. Like, you do. But you still a regular Dang. person. You're I, can't, a, I can't say that because no, I know some no, niggas who stand on it. No, 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 no. I ain't talking. I, you know I be involved. You feel me? What These I'm saying niggas is, is halfway when square halfway shit out. goes on, square shit goes on. And this nigga gets swept under the rug. And the nigga swear it never goes on. But square shit goes on from time to time. That's some all of these the niggas. Time. Not all these niggas. I, so, at all because every mm -hmm. rule is some written okay so at first so now sauce walker still some pimpin but then he didn't went only a lot like, of you get what i'm saying a lot of like niggas politic on that though but a lot what are your politics when i'm rich money don't public. make everything but, it, no 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 listen listen, listen, go listen. Ahead, go we ahead. stand on this nigga uh it's it's not about the uh, the the means to the end it's not about the end it's the means to the end you get what i'm saying yeah absolutely the means have to justify the end not the other way around but i'm so saying the money you don't matter how you got that both shit of mm -hmm. both of y'all being entertainer pips then fuck something for free and you don't have to respond mm. yeah don't respond <laughs> look i'm just saying because you like my brothers Y'all done fucked up for free before. Well, it, it could have been. You don't have to. Once upon a time, that's when, when you were young and fucked up. Don't even Not when you really standing on that I shit. Did, I haven't when seen you a kid it. just getting your feet wet and you stumbling on shit, of course, because you just learned it. But as a grown ass man who got trophies and things of this sort, things like that should never go down. Yeah, when you a every, young, dumb pimp, you most definitely go, to what you I'm got a miss pimp to learn how to pimp. Yeah. These fools on here arguing about sex trafficking. Come on, dog. Like, y'all know this is illegal, right? You know you can catch 100 years for that. How you guys feel? Jump in the cover. Let's get back into it. So but just when, when you is, just got trophies, that's like saying a nigga who, who who wins Super Bowls and shit and he cheating, putting shit on the glove. I ain't talking about it's just him. Steep I'm, talking you know about, I'm, I'm not just talking about him. I'm talking about every pimp that I've ever kicked it with in my entire life. When that bad bitch come around and she don't got the shit and we out of town and we parlaying, you taking her to the room and you, you don't lie ones. to me. What you gonna say? She bought you some breakfast, nigga? Cause you didn't get a fee. I mean, it, is one. it safe to say, Brick, though, that the same can be said? I'm just saying, I've seen it a hundred times. niggas that's How you go from pushing shit. pee to drinking it? <laughs> <laughs> He, he got that written down in his phone. He's for sure. For, for sure. He's <laughs> waiting for that. I'm going to drop a, uh, that bar into a song in the near future. A new a new definition of the word pimp, pimp, pee. Oh, <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. Adam 22, please don't make any more songs. Thank you.
say some shit like that too. <laughs> yeah, like as an entertainer, I wouldn't even have paid that shit. I said all that to say, like I wouldn't even have paid all that damn homie shit that much attention. No, him him leaning into it and actually fighting back fucked it up. Fan the flames, they one thousand percent. He had her fucked up when he wasn't saying nothing. And she look, just was if, talking to the if air. He was. If he was a young, dumb, and growing pimp, you feel me? Then, all right, we gonna politic on you. We gonna throw you in a circle and we gonna chop you verbally. You feel me? Regardless, because these these are things that shouldn't be happening. We gonna chop you verbally. You get what I'm saying? But when you young, dumb, these things should have, these, these things, I'm not gonna say should, but they do because you learn it. You get what I'm saying? That's like when you just getting in basketball and you still traveling a little bit or you still, you know what I'm saying? 100%. You still learn it. But when you a pro and you out there doing doing silly travels and, and, and you get what I'm saying? But it's also these the things same shouldn't thing be allowed. The, but also, what about, what about the how you guys feel about uh Sharps P? You know what I'm saying? His his what he be doing, you know what I'm saying? Like the way they arguing about this, like it ain't even illegal, is just crazy to me. But let's get back into it. End of your career though. These niggas like, think about this. Look at this. Like um Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Okay, we don't even want to hear us. I guess that's all Adam Twenty Two had to say. If you want to see everything, watch the whole clip. He wasn't saying too much. You get what I'm saying? Like he he was just trashing Sharp, like you know he does. Like Every time somebody leaves, he trashes them. But until next time, I'm out.